Most everybody knows it's coming and can stop it. Most everybody stops using it because everybody knows it and they're doing it the wrong way. So none of it really works, but I'm going to show you guys how to do it the right way so that you know how to stop it the right way and you can stop using it because it's not going to work. I'm just so the whole idea is again, okay, you're going to break down the posture here. Okay? One good way to get your hand on the collar is go on this side, push the head across, okay? All right? And you're breaking their posture. He's gonna wanna block this bicep because this is the second half of the choke. As he postures up, I cup his elbow, I move him out this way, to my side, bring my knee right under my fist right here, and I'm pulling him into this frame. But get up, and then I wanna hook screw and get up. Okay, I don't wanna just get up to my knees. I don't wanna be here. No pressure. Okay, so going back. Here you break down the posture, whether you got the grip like this here, you have his elbow and you're pulling it as he postures up, your right foot goes on the mat, push him this way. And it's a frame right here. So he's already tilting. So look over your left shoulder and scissor. And then you get to the top. Okay, you stay here, whatever's available. His arms will probably be tucked in. You have this grip here, you could reposition it and start being able to set up arm bars from here if you can. If not, you get to the top. Okay. The top person is going to have one or two positions with their knees. They're going to either be wide or narrow. Because typically everybody knows the wider your base is, you're going to have a wide knee position. Okay, which is gonna make it difficult to do this scissor sweep right here, okay? So you have to do a push sweep. That's oftentimes why it doesn't work in the beginning, okay? Because everybody knows, oh, I'm just gonna wide down my knees. So for drilling purposes, so you guys get the mechanics of it, the person in the guard's gonna have a narrow base, okay? So that you're gonna feed that collar, they block your bicep. Up the elbow, you pull it in, okay, right foot on the mat, and I'm gonna push him this way as my knee comes through here, and I'm tilting him onto the opposite side of the center line that goes from his head down through his tailbone. As this foot chops, he's already going, and I'm gonna scissor and look over my left shoulder, and then I'm gonna mount right here the hips so I can keep this choke here because sometimes. You can get it from here and be able to finish that. But the key is the scissor sweep. Okay? Huh? Down, down, down. You're just gonna start like this. You're gonna break the posture down. Grip the label. It's gonna block the bicep. You're gonna cup or grab the tricep with like a three finger grip. You don't wanna just do this. Okay? And be nice and neat. Seam like a three finger judo grip here. And you're gonna fold it out. So tight. You see how it's not on the bicep? Pull him down. He slowly postures up. As he postures up, my right foot goes on the mat. He postures up. And I got him to my left. As my knee slides in. If you notice, I'm on Phillips' right, uh, left side. Opposite of the side I'm going to sweep it towards. This foot stays off the mat. And you're spurring. Okay? and I'm pulling him into my knee. So if I look that way, I'm able to pull through the knee right here. Yeah, that's really what I want. Last time, yeah. Gonna open, see that label, grab that label, he blocks. You get that three finger shooter gripping here. You put your right foot on the mat, Push them away, slide the knee through, chop right here, okay? You gotta pull him like a bar, like I'm holding a, like a staff and trying to break that staff in half with my knee. This is really what I want. This is really what makes the scissor sweep work because if he sits back, okay, and gets heavy on that knee, it's tough to sweep it here. I can always pull him up, make this light, kick him over, and then begin to hook screw the pressure. See how that shoulder grip in his face? 
That's what you want. Okay. So let's try that and then we'll fix it. One, two, three.